Hello Earth citizens. In this video, I will show you a 10 minute routine to send energy to your loved ones. It's the holiday season now and you and your family might be doing something in person or this year you might have to meet virtually for your family gatherings. Whatever the case may be in person or remotely, energy can transcend time and space. So using this technique, I can show you how to send love, send energy, send healing from your body to your family members, whether they're near, far, here, or way over there. To be able to send energy, you have to recognize one thing. Recognize that you are a transmitter of energy. In other words, you are a channel of energy that can receive into your body and then send what you receive. So it's a little bit different from you sending your energy and squeezing your energy for your family members because if you keep squeezing your own energy, you're going to feel drained, you're going to feel tired and depleted. So it's not about you squeezing your energy and sending it out to people. It's about you first receiving energy, pure, bright energy from the purest, brightest place in the universe we call source. In other words, we call life particles too. I made a video about life particles, so I'll link it in the description below so you can know a little bit more about the purest, most elementary form of energy in the world. So you first receive this bright energy into you, let it flow, let it pass, and then send it to the people you want. So the exact technique I'll do with you together, but please keep that in mind, that you're not squeezing your own energy, you're just a channel, a medium for energy to come into you first, so it recharges you first, and then be able to send it to whoever you want, your loved ones, for the purpose of this video. So to begin, first sit with your spine straight. If it's difficult for you to sit like this on the floor, sitting on a chair is okay, just make sure your feet are flat, and straight so not like this not crossed like this your feet are flat on the floor and straight and straighten your spine straighten your spine and rest your hands palms facing up on your knees close your eyes focus on your breathing Take a few natural, gentle breaths in through your nose, out through your mouth to relax your body, get your mind into your body first. And now, with your mind's eye, your third eye, visualize the person you are sending energy to. So if this person is right in front of you through Zoom, you can just imagine their face right in front of you in your mind's eye, we say your mind screen. Imagine their face in front of you, or if they're physically in front of you, you can have them sit in front of you. Or if they're really far away and they're not zooming with you, they're just there and you want to send energy to them, visualize their face in front of you with your mind's eye. Have this person's face clearly in your mind, sitting in front of you. And then now, bring your right hand to the top of your head and gently tap your seventh chakra. The highest point on your head, tap your seventh chakra with your fingertips. Tap, 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 tap. This is the energy point we will receive energy to send to our loved ones. Gently tap here for 30 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine thirty relax your hands back down and now visualize a pillar of light bright golden light coming from the source the purest place in the universe coming down and touching the top of your head 
A bright beam of energy comes down and touches your seventh chakra. Imagine that energy coming down from your seventh chakra to your forehead, face, chin, throat, to your heart, and from your heart it splits into two and flows down your left and right arms from your shoulders to your biceps to your elbows forearms wrists and to your palms focus your mind on your palms the middle of your palms and slowly lift your palms three inches above your knees and feel your palms one more time. If you're sensitive to energy, you will feel a tingling sensation, a magnetic sensation, a warm sensation. These are all signs of energy flowing inside of your body. Keep visualizing this stream you're constantly receiving energy down to your seventh chakra, to your chest, down your arms, to your palms. Keep receiving, keep receiving, keep receiving. And now turn your palms towards this person you want to send energy to, whether they are physically in front of you or in front of you through your imagination or in front of you through Zoom or any other video platform. Face your palms towards this person. And now from your palms, as you receive energy to your seventh chakra, chest, down your arms, let this pure bright energy from your palms now shoot out to the person in front of you. And visualize this light going into their chest, their heart chakra. You are a medium, a channel, a transmitter of energy. You are not pushing out your own energy. You are simply receiving and letting the energy flow out to your palms and to this person. And now slowly move your hands around. And imagine with your palms, you are caressing this person's head with energy. You are sending bright light from your palms into this person's brain around this person's head. Visualize this person receiving pure bright energy and see how their expression changes in your mind screen. As you keep receiving and watching this person, see how they react to the energy. And now bring it down in front of their chest one more time, send energy to their heart. Send energy to their heart, bright golden beams of light are coming into your body from the top of your head, flowing to your chest, down your arms, and shooting out to the person in front of you. Can you feel this energy flowing inside? If you're sensitive to energy, you will feel your whole body becoming warm. You will feel your whole body tingling. Keep focusing, keep focusing. And then now lower your hands, imagine it in front of their belly button. Without touching, just sending energy to their belly button so that their organs can become healthy. Their stomach, liver, intestines, the center of their physical health, their abdomen, send bright energy to their core so that they can become physically healthy and strong. Keep receiving bright light and send it to this person.
And now again to their head with your hands, visualize yourself caressing their head. If they're in front of you, please don't touch them. Just with energy. Have space between your palms and this person and only communicate through energy. And one more time to their chest, into their heart space. Send warm, loving light into their heart space. And then now down to their belly button one last time. Healing energy goes into their abdomen, into their organs, making them healthy and vibrant and strong. And now rest your hands on your knees and bring your mind back into your own body. Breathe comfortably. Bring your mind back into your own body. And now slowly open your eyes. How did you do? One thing I forgot to mention is that if this person is actually in front of you, if your family is doing something in person and you have the chance to send energy to them directly, have this person also sit with their spine straight, closing their eyes and feeling you sending them the energy. And when you send energy, don't touch them. Just have space between your palms and them and send energy like this. Yes. If the receiver can also receive with an open heart, open mind, then the effects of the healing will double. But if this person is not in front of you, if they're on Zoom or some other video platform, you can also have them focus by closing their eyes and feeling their body as you send energy. Or if they're off and you don't know what they're doing, it's okay too. You can still focus on them and send energy. Yes. So this holiday season, I know these are strange times, strange circumstances, and we all want to be with our family together. But if you're not able to do that this year, then at least try to meditate and send some good energy to your loved ones near and far. You did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you.